Hey guys, Alex Sturgeon here for a special What's New. Uh, I'm not going to call it What's New Wednesday because it's not Wednesday, it's Thursday. Uh, we really didn't get a whole lot of new stuff in um, this week. Uh, so what I wanted to do was uh, during this whole uh, coronavirus deal where everybody's trying to find something to do while they're inside, I wanted to show you guys a couple of our aisles that have uh, some unique stuff um, that you probably can't, well, I hear every day that we can't find everywhere else. Um, like puzzles and some art supplies and different things. So, um, first off, we've had these for a while. These are called uh, uh, plus plus. They're they're basically like um, bricks, like uh, Tetris almost shaped bricks that you build stuff out of. So, uh, like here's a rocket. Um, here's uh, me and my wife holding hands. Um, there's a Christmas tree. Uh, they have these bases for them that you can build. Um, we have a whole kit here of just 3D blocks that you can build up and then we have a whole bunch of these small ones they're only like five bucks um, the bases with the pieces are like ten uh, most of these guys here and then the tubes are gonna be ten bucks um, you know uh, we have magnets we have magnet sets so if you're uh, if you're if, if, if you have to teach your child about science what you can do is you can use this to do uh, some sort of um, lab on uh, magnetism and magnets how about that huh that's uh, your noggin. Uh, okay, uh, puzzles. Oh my gosh. Okay, so uh, our puzzle aisle has been replenished uh, usually three times a week uh, as with as many puzzles as we can find right now. So um, we used to kind of kind of be kind of picky about what puzzles we do. Not anymore. Now we just find whatever we have in stock and we order them because people are just coming in and they're buying puzzles. We have a lot of thousand piece puzzles. Um, 500 piece puzzles, even smaller, but most people are, that, that have been calling this stuff have definitely been looking uh, for the thousand piece puzzles. So, uh, Cobble Hill is a brand that we're able to get. Um, there's some Ravensburger ones, I think, although most of the Ravensburgers are now out of stock everywhere. Um, we, uh, we did have some 3D puzzles. We still do. We've got a couple of them down there. Uh, they're even uh, discounted. Um, but, uh, I, uh, I'm kind of digging the Cobble, Cobble Hill stuff. Um, they've got, uh, once again, uh, lots of fairies and dragons uh, for your pleasure here. And uh, there were some uh, really cool Star Trek ones um, that we had, but I think people have finally bought those. Uh, they included like a, like a Star Trek puzzle. So I was all over them, I was gonna buy them, and then I realized that I, don't, I wouldn't have time to put together any puzzles, so I left them for the customers and just like that, they were gone. Uh, horses, uh, landscapes, uh, there's a Harley. Um, here's, uh, uh, which one is that? Oh yeah, look at that. That's a uh, good Easter, even though we're past Easter, but whatever. Little, little baby Jesus there. And uh, yeah. Okay, another really popular item that's, uh, that we've uh, decided to just go all, all out on because uh, we can find them are these really cool uh, diamond dots um, I wouldn't necessarily, they're not really puzzles, they're, they're, they're art mats or something, right? Isn't that what they are? Um, so, we used to have only like this many, and now we have this many, okay? So, uh, if you haven't been in here within the last week or so, we got all these new diamond dot puzzles, or, they're not puzzles, but you know what I mean. Um, we got all these things in, I think on, uh, I think last Friday or, or maybe even Monday or something like that. Either way, we've got a lot of them. They're really cool. My favorite one, of course, is the uh, is the astronaut. Look at that. Because you know, space. Uh, look up Parallax Nick here on uh, on YouTube. That's my favorite guy to watch. Uh, I, lately, um, I don't watch the normal normal TV anymore. Um, I've been bringing up YouTube. And one of my favorite guys uh, is, is that I'm subscribed to is Parallax Nick, and uh, I'll just put on one of his playlists and then and then listen to it as I go to sleep. So I'm hoping that by some sort of weird uh, nighttime osmosis that I get smarter in my sleep, uh, knowing about space and stuff like that. So not that you guys needed to know that, but whatever. Um, engraving arts, we've had these for a really long time. I've worked here now for 16 years. This has been a Hobbyplex staple in our art section. Uh, paint by numbers has been really good. 
Uh, we have some other um, coloring books and uh, art kits and stuff. We have a tiny little bit into Legos. Um, not a lot. It's really hard for a small store like us to be competitive price-wise uh, with Legos and everything, but we do carry a little bit. And uh, yeah, some other fun things like uh, uh, marbles, fiddlesticks. We've got a lot of the Rubik's Cube stuff that's been a really popular item here. Um, if we turn around real quick, we've got some games. Um, this has been a really popular one. A lot of people have been calling for this one, the Foodies. Um, and we've got some classics, uh, Yahtzee, um, Candyland, you can see over there. Um, Ticket to Ride is another one that's been, that's been asked about a lot. Um, Twister. Twister is really fun to play alone uh, with your significant other. Super fun. Kind of weird with the kids. I got to be honest with you. Um, let's see. Yeah, if we go over here, uh, we got lots of free flight stuff. Um, so when it's nice again, not snowing like it is now, uh, we've got lots of uh, cool uh, free flight airplanes that you can you can put together. Um, don't require any special skill other than reading like a three like a three uh, a three section instruction manual, you know. And uh, my favorite uh, telescopes got lots of those too, uh, so you can get out there at night and uh, and check out what's going on. There was supposed to be a cool comet called Atlas. Uh, but unfortunately it broke up and we won't be seeing it uh, anytime soon with the naked eye but there might be another one in May sometime so keep my fingers crossed um, yeah that should do it for what we got I just wanted to give you guys uh, a good example of all the stuff that we have besides what we're really known for with RC cars and planes and um, and show you guys uh, the other side of the store a little bit and stuff that we can do while we're all trying to uh, keep ourselves occupied through this whole uh, coronavirus thing so uh, we're still open, regular hours. Um, you can check us out on, uh, you can find us on Google, of course, but uh, make sure you subscribe and like to this channel. Uh, we'll do uh, after hours every Thursday. Uh, we got our new podcast live stream every Monday, right around 6, 6.30, whenever we get started with that. And uh, hopefully we'll make another video for you soon.